Persons with disabilities around the world continue to face heightened vulnerabilities in the wake of natural disasters, conflicts, and other crises. Developing countries like Guyana are also becoming increasingly vulnerable to devastating impacts of natural and man-made hazards, which disproportionately impact people with disabilities. Therefore, it is crucial, Chair, that persons with disabilities be prioritized in disaster risk management activities. And I'm pleased to share with you the story of Guyana. Guyana's National Commission on Disability holds a permanent seat on the National Disaster Risk Management Platform. This mechanism ensures that persons with disabilities are among the first to receive humanitarian aid and psychosocial support in times of disasters and emergencies. The government of Guyana recognizes that reliable data is essential for effective planning and response to humanitarian emergencies and is currently conducting a situation analysis of persons with disabilities to inform and respond to their needs, particularly those in situations of risk. Comprehensive disaster risk management legislation is also currently being drafted and will guarantee the inclusion of persons with disabilities in planning and prioritize their needs in disaster preparedness, response, and recovery. Chair, the growing prevalence of acquired disability as a result of conflict, such as the war in Gaza, is a stark reminder of the need for more to be done to protect our people. Guyana remains committed to ensuring that the protection and safety of persons with disabilities are adequately and systematically addressed through policy, legislation, and humanitarian action. Thank you.